What is up, everybody? This is Poe Daddy Samoan Ray. Just real quick, subscribe to my channel, comment down below, and stuff that you need me to explain, whether it's about this game or not. Real quick, this is a quick video about your inventory space and just a few game tips that I feel might help you so that you don't have to go through 30 videos to figure out how to play. First off, this is my character, Doctor Strange. There's a variety of characters. Um, I, I've heard and I've also kind of somewhat researched that Doctor Strange is the easiest character to use. Uh, but I just wanted to share my my character, Doctor Strange. She's one of my favorite Marvel characters in the Marvel Universe. Uh, currently, I'm at level 70. I'm not one of the best players on this game, but I just... This is me just trying to... If I was you, like how you found yourself into my video, what I would have liked to have known as I had played from the beginning till now. So here's my guy, Doctor Strange, level 70, and so forth. Now let's just... Go ahead and quickly jump into the why we're here watching this video. As you continue to play, you'll realize that you are running out of space. That's this part right here. Now, first off, I just wanted to quickly say that, yes, I did spend money on this game. I spent roughly around 30 bucks. I might spend another 10 bucks. We'll see. I don't like to waste money on games if you're like me. I just try to maximize and farm as much as I can, but... Uh, farming takes too long and yeah so the first thing you want to do is once you find yourself running out of space you'll realize you can't even play the damn game so in inventory the first thing you need to realize is you'll is your, what you'll realize is you have a ton of collectibles now I don't have any more because I've already done what I'm trying to explain to you guys but you'll realize you have a lot of collectibles Maybe you'll even have a lot of battle badges. You'll maybe even have a few cores and definitely you'll have a lot of one star, two star costumes. Now what you want to do in inventory is the reason why I bought, paid for stuff is because I wanted to open up this space. And the maximum you can have in your inventory is 250 items. And I, I opened it up to that. As you can still see, 30 bucks a month into playing somewhat. I have still have 1,200 crystals as I continue to play the game and played. Now, in your inventory, what you want to... The collectibles are made to bring yourself over here to this area called the Convergence Box. Once the Convergence Box opens up, what you want to do is you want to go to it in the map, Convergence Box. And you'll see that you'll have one of these five things to obtain. Now, to obtain those, you need to have synchronized particles. That's this right here on the bottom right. To get synchronized particles, you have to extract those collectibles, which will be under this um, beeper or beaker. Uh, and you'll have all the stuff that you can actually throw into making a synchronized particle. So what you do is you go ahead and select those uh, uh, items, the collectibles, right? And you go ahead and... Boom, right there. You select the money and, and extract those items. Now, first quick tip is do not use your cores, this stuff right here. Don't even use your costumes to make synchronized particles, okay? That's the stuff here. Just use your collectibles, maybe even some of your badges or any of your one-star, two-star badges. Uh, but primarily, just use your collectibles, okay? Once you extract those items, you go ahead and select synchronize particle, synchronize the stuff that you've extracted, and you'll get one of the five items. Now that's the first tip in making space in your inventory. The next step, once this um, machine opens up to you as well, you'll find yourself over here at the workshop. As you can see this top left, you're at the workshop now. And at the workshop, you'll be able to convert these consumables. You see them? They're called consumables. And what those consumables do, if you're dumb like me and don't realize what, they've do, what they do do, is they're material used to craft costumes from these areas, like New Stark City, Xander, Hydra Empire, and so on. Now, if you don't know what these consumables or what costumes you want, or sometimes you'll be able to pick 
Um, I think I'll be able to show you. Yeah. Costume draw tickets. Let's show. An inventory, because I purchased one. Let's see. Oh, it's right in here. Okay, anyways, let's continue. Um, you'll be able to make, use the consumables to make your costumes. Obviously, you have to have all four of these things and so forth. Now, let's just go quickly to game tips. Once you're able to make these as well, the attack answers, these are mid-grade ones, okay? Make them. If you have the coins, make them. They'll help so much with fighting off um, bosses and uh, most wanted characters that you need to, uh, so that you can continue to increase the stuff that you receive and also uh, your character. Um, most of the stuff you'll need under this third option is stable convergent particles and crystallized convergent particles. Um, those things are in instant create and um, You'll eventually, these ones you can actually get when you collect the Convergium particle, uh, stuff, crystals in the gameplay, in, in, in gaming, okay? So you don't really need to make them unless you're just trying to create your costumes, okay? So like this, you need stable Convergium particles, and on this left side, you can just make it, okay? That's one way to get rid of your consumables, okay? The other thing to make space in your in your inventory is to head over, once it's available as well, to the core synthesizer. In the core synthesizer, that's where these core um, stuff, when you select them, you can create two stars. It's a three, one stars and a two stars, two stars and a three stars. And what the cores do is under your hero info, you use them on your battle badges. You see right here? manage cores you just place them under your battle badges the ones that allow you to use cores to strengthen your your battle badges okay um and the battle badges obviously obviously you get from battling red skull you get them from blitz you get them from um boss bosses and so forth okay that's where you can minimize uh what you do with the cores and make a little bit of space if you bring yourself over here as another quick gameplay the costume enhancer actually opens up a lot quicker i don't recommend you go to this too much unless you don't care i the, my favorite part of the game is the costumes so what you want to do in the costumes if you don't care is the quickest way is just click on this combine or you can select which one so that you can pick which one you don't care about and you got to pick five you see five one star stuff so let me pick something else because like this three star okay now the reason why you want to manually pick it is if you actually know your costumes you can just pick which one you don't care for right or pick the ones that are doubled and then you can actually combine it to make a four star um a four star costume of that costume okay or if you don't care just click combine let it pick pick and then you can make the three star costume into a four star costume uh generally it's a lot easier so that you can make sure that you make this costume into a four star costume that's why you want to pick it instead of just combine okay that's how you minimize in your inventory your costumes now the other quicker way to um, to make space in your inventory, sorry it's taking so long, is when you go over here to this top right corner and click this to get to this screen. Um, you want to take yourself over to squad and storage. Now in squad and storage, you'll find that you can actually store any one of these stuffs but as you can see on my bottom right i already used a hundred um items of sp in this space now those hundred items of space is my badges because i have a lot of them because i play a lot of blitz and stuff and as you can see i sent over the two star three star four star five star whatever 
because I don't need those badges anymore because I've already got the top badges over here on the left. And what I can do is on my other characters, I can use, once it's allowed, any one of these two, three, four stars for them. And that's how you make more space in your inventory is by going over here to squad, going over here to storage, and just throwing them over here into storage. And you can, that's another 100 space. So technically, you'd have 100 plus 100 over here in storage. Now, hopefully that helps. A quick other tip, I know this video is already long, is under operations, play the blitz, play the, sorry, play the blitz, play the most wanted, play the special operations, play the battle challenges, play the Omega War, play the dimensional duel. And when you are in an alliance, please, guys, oh, in the alliance, under alliance shop, what you want to do is purchase these two things, the core box and the potential report. You get those once a week. So save your coins for that as well. And then help your alliance by at least donating every day. 10 grand at least every day. All right, guys. I've talked a lot. It's been over 11 minutes. I hope you guys have fun. Um, welcome to the game. Hopefully I help. Comment, subscribe down below. Hope you guys have fun. Peace.